Hi guys, this is your ideal butterfly, Tule Tando, chilling with the Gemini with the swagger, the queen of work hard and slay, VVA. And this is T Trends on Thursdays. So we're going to jump right to start our September, the month of heritage, the month of independence, mm -hmm. by celebrating everything culture and tradition and all creators, all events that are around about celebrating that same theme. With all that being said, we're going to be celebrating Mokota Wale Sosa. An annual food cultural event mm -hmm. and African on flick. Also, we're going to be having tea trending on the polygamy issue. Stay tuned. What are the people saying about polygamy? Huh? So tune in. Do remember to comment and do remember to send us. Would it just engage with us in whatever way possible? The WhatsApp number or the call-in number will be displayed right below on the screen. Now, the right show. about now, we're just about to reminisce a little bit on the fourth edition of Mokoto Wale Soso. Enjoy this video. From As you can see that we're busy with Shoshong Homonati. Well, actually, Kitsile Mokoto Wale Soso, you know, it's a cultural festival that belongs to Shoshong. And obviously, everybody has to have his own outfit. As you can see that I'm putting more outfit in Yaka, you know, the shoes, the glowing and everything and the hair. Yo, but I'm going to go to the show. Litmus is the moment. I know, guys. I literally, literally feel so sad once again. Jorge, we did yeah. not manage to have the fifth edition. Because the fourth was out of this place. Yeah. But let's just cry. Let's get all our news. Let's just cry with the one of the organizers, Rito <laughs> Jorge. But how, is, how are they taking this whole pandemic, the situation, the fact that we can have events going on, and the fact that they did not have that fifth edition? So let's just call the PRO of Flamboyant into Entertainment BW, Simoloho. You also can call in. If you see the number on the screen, please do call in and let us know what your feelings are on this particular event. Reminisce with us. Wear whatever your cultural attire is. Get your food. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Tims. Hi. Hello. Welcome to Tea Trends on Thursdays. Thank you, guys. Yes, this is your ideal me. butterfly, and Nintendo. it's BDA. Yes. So, Timuloho, we are just reminiscing on Mokoto Wale Soso Food Festival, which we understand happens on each and every end of August, right? Go So, please yes, take us through on true. that event, that baby of yours. Um, well, it's an event that started about five years ago. We are supposed to be celebrating the fifth one this year. Mm -hmm. um, so it's an annual event. It's a, it's a cultural event. Yes, it's one. Basically, concept that thing was to depict um, cultural, culture. Mm -hmm. Just to talk about this, what's up? We have a how did the people come to settle there? Um, the mm -hmm. um, the because kana buntijwa di ngwa tsa rona tsa setswana. Mhm. Eh, di a overlap, di 
di gona le ha di tshwana ntle mbunzi ba tsone me gona le ha di harologana ntle so Tims, i, so, I want to understand this yeah. when you say you're trying to celebrate culture le dijo tsa tsana dijo tsa tsana tse is it limited to ngoya ba ngwato hela o ke dijo tsa tsana tse le gore di tsengele tsa rona ba kalaka and stuff on tswa dijo tsa tsana tse di kwa tse 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 di supang kwa tse di jwa to ta ke tsa tsana tse di general ya tse ribita nice nice me rabe re le mososhong ya be di mosi ya pe ke batho ba shoshong me o tshela le gore um ya ka ne ke bua gore di ngwa tsa rona dia ya a tsona from the different tribes ke go gona le bontsi ba a di tshwana ntle that many similarities from within within the tribes eh gona le ha go lohana ntle ja nong se se tona tona se neng se se neng se le re sa highlighta particular le ka shoshong ya ke mokoto mokoto ka ha ba wa pa anka teng ka ha ntse ka teng particularly wa wa ko shoshong ala wa se wa wa i have a question i have a question for you tsemologo i i don't mean to take you back too much but google o o o bua gore it's about celebrating uh the culture ya bangwa ba ko shoshong right so i want to understand what yeah. is there a particular time during the event where you guys take a moment to like share a little bit of history li whoever the people are attending kana li include up modi flyering how do you share that information you know the history yes from the onset we lela from the very first edition um we would have but the boom month to do bang wow batla 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 ro setsa batho ke program hela etsa mamoletsa tsinjana from from morning till till evening Uh-huh. Long hour. We have different speakers. Ba ngo ba long hour ki di expected sa ngwa ba ki di expected sa ngwa generally ya botswana. Le ba long hour they zoom in mo mo shoshong yela. Ba le be bona ki di speaker ba ya ma ba ba ruta ba ruta se chaba se 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 tilong ono ka 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 di ngwa ka di ngwa tsa rona. Okay. So it's a little hard. We even have uh we even have um uh a time where re tsa ba ba le nteng ho le bana kana di tlhela re bidite go tlhela bana ba ba nyane bana ba skolo ba go ba bontsha some some sites around some some old sites around shoshong to say ha le ne go iragala jana bogologolo ha thabeng ene ne go iragala yana bogologolo so yes Okay. So um briefly let us know how has this pandemic or this whole situation yeah we cannot have events going on. Mm. How has it really affected you as one of the organizers or as the organizer za mokotwa le so so just the body of entertainment. Exactly. As a body of entertainment like I I'm sure this is the worst year you've ever had as a as a entertainer. Um, master of entertainer. Um go bona nete the the uh, entertainment industry or creative industry yeah is the hardest hit ka ka ke covid True. um some industries have uh, obviously most industries the uh, the have been hit but this one particularly has been has been hardest hit mm. because um the players around um the the, the creative industry the entertainment industry i want to say that zira most most of us most of the um the players being maybe the performers the dj um people who are in the value chain you are looking at gomba the sound the baba provider mbodi toilet provider and this and that body bouncer you can imagine bouncer ba security ba long or we saw ba na ba hero a mo events so anything surrounding events has been killed because hare gone go na di events um because uh it's 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 very difficult to control um a huge crowd so that according to covid-19 protocols ke go leka on a social distancing lo gone go re batho ba ska ba khoboka so it it it's a, it's a, it's against the very essence of eventing yeah so that means all these people all these industries but but to all these players one nela hela go na se ba sidirang o ke ipotsa gore motho ele gore kana i can give you an example hela like i said in the value chain tsa bouncer ale di company tsa di security ba long gore ke di bouncer ba long gore it's their main job 
que son esas si gran weekend and week out ba ba bounce whether moody venting whether moody tlabong khona ana there is nothing ha khona go pego ba bounce tengo ke iputsa gore ba tsela yang where do they get the money for for the livelihood great the artist the performers ha khona go ba mo performelang um they khora gore ba be ile hela mo maybe the royal city di ka tswang from course bots Okay. And we understand that it is a very like very bad issue for everyone in the entertainment industry, and we do understand. Mm-hmm. But then, Timuloga, just to wrap it up, what is your final message to Bazona Kuchai regarding either this pandemic or a message coming from the Mokoto Wale Soso family? Just to close off, Lady Tolehetu Talna Tsangwa Kuchla. Okay. Um, we are very, very optimistic that uh, la 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 COVID, so that uh, things go back, things go back to 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 normal life and then normally normally. But the at least the, um, all industries to a point where all industries can open up. We have to keep an open mind um, because remember we are called creative industry we have to be creative mm. so serka tlanga sone eh from the entertainment sector but tsona ba sa mo gele we have to move towards um digitalization of all services wela when we go into the future so ha ri ra di tso ba tsona ba di a mo gele le bone ba itse gore eh nkile ane ke ira ka ticket ya 100 pula ke a mo kotwa le soso go mpieno go nwe ke ke ira ke in the form of data so we, we are like definitely moving towards, towards, towards that direction. All these events. Beautiful. Well, I, I, I don't mean to cut you short, since so let's just wrap it up and sending you love and strength as a creator, as a creative in our country. We yeah. appreciate you and the Flamboyant Entertainment BW family. Let's just arrive about now, call Flamboyant. Thank you, Timoloko. Have a great night. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, hey, Yo, guys, like he um, brought up a very important issue. Yeah, where the entertainment industry is suffering, and as we all know, the entertainment industry is one of the industries that will be the last considered to be reopened. Because Yonehela, like he said, in the very essence, it involves gathering of oh, people, yeah, exactly, and you need numbers for that. But and like he said, can't cut it. Let's keep an open mind for more creative plans on how we're gonna, you know. Jabul, eh? Exactly. So I think we should just fall back. I, 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 he forgot. I think he forgot to mention one thing about this event. Yeah. When, when, when you asked him the question, Yahore, does do we have a moment where you share wah, the wah, culture? Think, exactly. Eh, eh. Yeah. To add on what he said, we mm. literally they literally share that culture to an extent. They're go eventing, ne? Khonale, khonale, kolo khoteng. But like, go to gather the event at the VDC grounds. Yeah. So khonale kolo khoteng ko ilong The actual chief washoshong goes there and like all part of the event good mm. as that deep when it comes to celebrating culture mm. Mm. at this particular event which was sadly supposed to be on the 29th of august mm. but because of this pandemic we could not have it so we're gonna call flam boss and hear the what boss. he has to say their bigger boss what about and hear boss? what he has to say <laughs> regarding this mokotawale soso and the pandemic we are facing and just while we're calling Flambo, please don't forget to drop those comments on our live feed, guys. We want to know what you're thinking. Engage. And engage with us in your experience, Yamokoto Alessosa. Even if you're not talking about your experience, Ditolo hello. Flambo, hello. Hello. Hi, Flambo. What's up? Welcome to T Trends on Thursday. Thursday. This is your ideal flambo butterfly to Nintendo. With VVA. <laughs> so Flambos. Reta, Reta Flambos. So we are calling you regarding Mukata Wale Soso, ne? Yebo. And we happen to understand Horo Oza Sosong. And you happened to be there. Ka date in Lukhore in a betwe the fifth edition. Ya Mukata Wale Soso. Please tell us how the vibe was, Koshushong. Let me just put it that way. Never who it. Oh, it was it was sad. You know, I was I was actually there on the day. It just happened all the day ago. We should show and everybody somehow, you know, mobile twelve born and doing put a while. We should show. Ah, so we're about to say what's in. Yeah, like out like event. You know, but it was it was it was sad. But that day, right? Yeah, it was. 
Yeah. But then first thing that caught me was that I was shocked for it. Uh, even though even the next year, the Rally Mekenda is not just for a brand to put sale about the mask, yeah. the bucket, uh, mm-hmm. they buy them. Nice, nice. Just to one. say that. Yeah, that was good. Oh, I'm motivated a little now. In in our you know, these people buy it, but a little now they they believe in this brand, they love the brand. So, how do you how do you point out? You know, back up our whole idea of the T-shirt. So we did that, and I think that they will go to show by tomorrow. That's All really right. nice. That's really nice. So um, we're not gonna like uh, rahu kote nga mokone nga na wana kore udi ready promise nga na kore twenty twenty one. What are you serving? And is it going to be a sixth edition or it's a fifth point five edition? No, it's going to be a fifth. A fifth. Five is on zuri ra. Na zuri ra kalama otang. Five is on zuri ra. Straight up. La ba ka umuga kato twenty twenty five is on zuri ra. Mhm. Okay, yes. I think that that's just about that just all. Come got the wall, sister. We appreciate you so much, Flamboys. We send you love, butterflies, and strength as one of the creators, Bubbles and the big creators and event organizers, Bubbles and us. Thank you so much. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Now that was all. Come got the wall, sister. So we are about to just jump right into African attire on flick. Vivi, you honestly <laughs> need to own this one. Got it. We own it, just like you owned the stage. <laughs> Please own it, cause the whole time now, nah, promo girl, I was just there at the back. Guys, talking about Pushing African down. attire on fleek just pushes my mood down. Hey, everybody who knows African attire on fleek know that this show is a tour. It's not like a once-off thing mm-hmm. in a particular location. It's a tour. It goes to Palape, starts in Gaborone, goes to Palape, goes to Francis Town, goes to Mau. Mau. Now our last event was. Um, March the seventh, mm-hmm. where we had the it had we had completed the, the tour. tour. Yeah, we had completed the tour, and we were coming back for like a, a start over. Mm-hmm. We're beginning the second round of the tour. Now, this one was big. I had never, and I'm I'm gonna be honest with you, I had never seen a turn up like that in all of the events that I've emceed. That turn up was insane. Straight up. It was insane. It was it literally people from all walks of life who shared in the love of African attire. Can African attire moto it's just broad. Haraka nya le teisi hela. Ankara, there's Eswatini, there's the Zulu culture. Everybody was just displaying all of that. There is um, I saw one guy at Laiperimakhabe and it was so beautiful. Like this is celebrating because I think African attire celebrates more of the outfits Straight than up. the food. And like Mokota I like yeah, no eight. true. So it celebrates the outfits because people looked colorful. True. It was summer. Colorful they brought the pinks, the blues, makabe, and it was so amazing. But unfortunately, again, due to lockdown, due to the pandemic. But unfortunately, now we're in a standstill. In September, even now, we're still at a standstill. So if you have any comments regarding this event, guys. Engage with us. Engage with us. And if you're clueless on the event that we are talking about, we're just going to give you this opportunity to reminisce with us and watch the beautiful video. Watch the so clip. So make sure you enjoy. Honestly, though, but you see, African attire and a fleek is just—it's—it's it's just wow. I feel like African attire and fleek and Mokotwa and so so, and I'm saying these two because we are currently talking about them, yeah, not just the cutting the others. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. I feel like they have um, <laughs> made me appreciate African culture so much. On fleek. Like, Onzo oke tekuwa. Urula kanzo jalo ke banana kuto kuko mponi ebidu an colorful people. Maikala lo elho rotwe taba chana hui pela la mwao le sekhabo bogolo jang ka pari all the way from moraponi tlakane just to come and attend this beautiful event okay. so this event e bidwa african print on flick so ya be ke dirisa yone material e ke dirisang u bidwa african print so i decided to put this on material thing just to make this design like about a simple dress that is just nice and flowy see as denzel and uh, this is my first outing to the african attire picnic and uh, the reason why I came out today is because of uh, what this event means. It's a fusion of African cultures. We get to interact with uh, people from different countries, 
or different cultures, African cultures. Now we all know that that is always a vibe. Now imagine we're missing out on a vibe like this in, in September. Literally, and if you get covered with the dude, I literally saw my outfit. <laughs> I literally saw my outfit. And you know what's funny? I don't even know what I video and I got France on guy go for like my like show get covered because that vibe, somewhere. that vibe, somewhere. I could never miss such a vibe. I right? could definitely never miss such a vibe. I saw I saw a post on somebody uh, on social media this mm-hmm. morning when somebody said, "Aratlala la rebone wii puso di chari di si di pentiu." I'm like. <laughs> But for all of those, all of those who don't remember when African attire on fleek started, it, 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 it blew up when, um, it became the makeup picnic. Mm -hmm. The first one we had, Simi didn't show up. She was like, I think she was like the, the main act that was before. And then the second round, she showed up and it, it was named AAOF makeup picnic cv mm-hmm. makeup picnic so i think that's where it really blew up and then from there when it started moving and touring that's when people started taking notice we're like okay we Cheer. see where this is going i think that's why it made um bojanala such a big deal but Ma- also you know what they say about rome not being built in a day no literally yeah in yeah. every business any every event or any aspect in life hella the first the second and the third Mm-mm. go on go on like you want to see how you know what big Street. what are you offering is this like a once-off thing it needs to go i think on. i think the thing with Botswana is trust yes yeah they they the loyalty is built from trust but that to an extent okay if tando is creating a show how how what are you giving us exactly. what's different but i also feel like how are you growing when i trust it it's, yeah. a, it's a it's a 40 60 type of thing it's yeah. a 40 percent of trust i think the 60 goes to consistency you need yes. to be consistent with your content. yes consistency because fine for the first time Oh, no. I, I personally out go kata kata ta ka bobedi gore you want to hear her say baby wa ba ne ke ba ta go ta ba gore a ne dintsa a ba re thekile mo video a ne no boya go ba yana di a re go a ndi a ntsa a malaiti a phone a re guys where you at re tla go le pick and stuff like that we need consistency so how about the first no e bloile like in a little trial and error sharp second time e bloile third time everybody's taking everybody re na lwa yena i think that's how i found out about mokotwa le sosho because then Lanka, I was like, okay, probably it's just like an event. Because mm. <laughs> the name says Mokot, then you're not And I remember there was a time it. that I actually called you, okay, babes, I want to attend the fifth edition. I was supposed to attend the fifth edition. And then, well, the Rona. Well, you know your girl, wherever there's flam, I'm always there. So I, I never missed any. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please don't forget to comment. <laughs> Call us. Please call us on the number on the screen. Comment. Tell us what you're thinking. Let us know where you are. What do you remember from African attire on fleek? What do you remember from Mokota Lesoso? Shoshon, Khaboroen, Gabs, anything. Tell Post us. your pictures on the comment section. Mm-hmm. Let us know what you were rocking. What, what did you look on like? What did you look like? On these two events, engage with us. Oh, you might as well leave your number on the comment section. Wrong phone and hear what you want to say. Time. Can I wear or a spoiler or a collar and let's just engage. Talking about outfits, I remember. I remember when I was prepping for the African attire on fleek, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, I had to get. I had to get uh, an outfit. Let's say like African attire. So, the my supplier. I spoke to her. She's like, "I'm let's let's allow the regular. No, no, no." No, darling. it's not Khalidiri. It's just Kelaba. She's like Kelaba Hall. You wanna? <laughs> she told me this. She's like, this is when I was actually collecting. Mm-hmm. Like the day I was going to collect Huisa Komseri. She's like, you need to be bright. You need to be colorful. You need to be, you know, have that. The last and time, I'm like, girl. The last time somebody told girl. me, I need to have that. Yes, that's. I think I went overboard. I literally How? did. How? And how Tando? Because how? my fifth edition, Musu saw my fifth edition from Kotoal was ready in February. Oh, 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 not feathers per se, but you guys know how much get up and do it. Again. Now the problem was it had so much white and a dash of blue, which is the African print. Can so I look like a whole so, so, bride. Halena, Halena, kate again. How is the white gonna work for you? There was okay, yeah, the sand gone or red, but I didn't care about that. Red on white. Yeah, where one central away. Yeah, the carpet and comfortable thing was enough for 
me. Kind of the aim was to light cameras, light action. Listen, well, guys, after that girl or did not Wherever know. Tando is, know that she's going to be a little too too <laughs> extra. Tando was guys. How guy. do you a promo girl in? <laughs> In a VIP table because for the need, why? They need to understand. No, listen. I wasn't just selling an event. I wasn't selling you a were. ticket. I wasn't selling a merchandise. I was selling an experience. And Mokoto Wale also to me was an experience. Hey. It's a lifestyle because we had the actual cultural event during the day, and then my happy We had the after party. After party was where we were at all night long. All night long. So without wasting any time, let's just jump right. Into the tea that trends on a Thursday. What Kana is it about? <laughs> Don't quote me on Ma this. Bara bara Kanya. Polygamy. Polygamy. Good bar. Give me a little bit of 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 I think Hakira Polygamy is enough for them to understand where we're going with this. Tando. Yes. Would you like yourself an extra pair of men? No. <laughs> no. But the guys in the, in the studio. What's that song airing? Um, Lenya Loki Laba Baby. Waburaru. No. Something, something. Hey, hey, hey. Mm. My song right now. Yes. My mood Guys, right now. For all those who don't know what polygamy is, polygamy is a traditional practice that is. <laughs> Stop it. We share food, ne? We share ideas. We share job opportunities. Must, let's explain what polygamy is. For those who don't know, polygamy is a, a, a cultural practice that allowed men to take in more than mm-hmm. one wife. Two, three, ten. Yon kinto, pagad. And we've seen this being practiced today. I think the perfect example would be the culture of Eswatini. Mm-hmm. They still take it. I don't know if the Zulu culture still does it, but Eswatini still practices it and we like. My head on. Ba woke. And but you know, then, but then another thing is, note that, now nah, I still remember my moral education. I keep talking about Baba eating moral when There is also a branch that defines polygamy in terms of a woman taking in more than one husband. It's called polyandry. Go back to your religious model education. You will see. No, so it works for both. I was actually laughing because I was reading the comments here. Yeah. From um Batewan and Bakomenta Kakanyoni. So one is like We're not name dropping guys. Oh. No, we are not. If, <laughs> like, if you want to see the comments for yourself, go to the page. I yeah, think we're on the link. And oh my, oh Tell them what these people say. Ari. Okay, this one is funny because on Kinale now and but in a way, Ari. Um, wait, wait, wait! Before you read it, are you for polygamy or against it? Against. Good. It. Yeah, but I need who? to establish a stand. Let I me get explain. It. If we're gonna talk about this, we need to establish a stand. You are Before I, 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 I go on with the comments, let me explain why I am against. Okay, again. Go on. <laughs> wait, not going. wait, zoom in. Zoom in on the camera. Zoom in on her face. You see, Eka, like I literally want to speak in Kalanga, but I will get back to that. Obana Koloiz. Kopil. Yeah. Everybody else. Everybody else. Our babies. Our body babies. The products or the, the bonus. The products are the two. The front seaters. Never we tell. Because I'm trying to understand. Okay, so sharp. If Habi I, uh, married, Habi gets another wife. Who's sitting at the back? Girl, because I ain't sitting at the back. Mm-hmm. And she is sitting at the front and she's not driving. She's a difficult one, man. Habi has to drive. True. And he's the head of the family. And like Kachi says, mm. as much as Molala is not So I'm going to go to the second one. That's just in here. The third person, guys, you need to engage into the comment section and let me know. Let us know. Are you for or are you against? And if you're against, back me up. Back yeah, me up. Bro. Because, yeah, Lone, no. Ha, 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 no. Uh-uh. What are you saying? If you're going to say polygamy needs to. Hi, Warabile. She just said hi on the comments. Okay, hi, Warabile, Waring. Like, Waring, are you, 
Are you with me? Are you with me? You can talk again. Nah, nah, I'm not sure, guys. Jo. Let me tell you why I'm not sure on this case. See, polygamy, polygamy is, is, it's, it's, okay. I don't work at the one area thing where a man takes more women. Um, it's, mm-hmm. it, it's, it's pro in a situation where a man, guys, don't quote me on this. You see, now I don't want to talk about this because now you're going to quote me, but this is my you point You need to leave your words. This is my point of view. Um, I believe that polygamy can be good in a situation where probably the first... I think we're having a caller. We're having a caller. Okay. Caller, hello. Hi. Hi. I'm good. How are you? Uh, Too sad. And why only sad, mister? Hey, guys. So wait, wait. You're commenting on this particular polygamy issue. Are you are you for it or against it? I'm you are for it. it. E- e- get other gender. Get other gender so we understand. Okay, can you p- ex- explain your reasons, Mar? Why are you for polygamy? <laughs> so your stand on polygamy is that the women will act as a stress li- reliever to all of your problems. <laughs> uh-huh. Mm-hmm. How uh, let, let's do this? Uh, uh, we can't. We I'm struggling with your network. You. Let's just try to call you back right about now. But thank you so much. Uh, we appreciate you and your comment. Thank you and good night. Oh stress my God! Leave. Did that man just say Hannah is stress? Good. Okay, I give the whole kid the petty girl. Your ring, really stress relief. But good. Give the whole kid. Hey, just stress is okay. Stress is okay. I'm not on business. I too. But here's the thing, right? Men, the thing is, good. The problem is, I will generalize it sometimes. But at most of the time, we generalize it too much. Mm-hmm. Some people he use the word stress reliever. Some people say, mm-hmm. but he's arguing it as a point of a stress reliever. Imagine if you're dealing with five women at the same time, and they're all. I'm sorry, I just feel like one person is already a problem. It's enough. So anything you more than that. You understand one person. Okay. Then how are you going to spend your v, life v, take understanding me back. five? Take me back. If if you're saying polygamy is a sharp, right? Oh yeah, gonna before he called, I was still explaining why. Gary, mm-hmm. polygamy would be fine. And it's not polygamy about to balance five, maybe two wives. In a in a situation where somebody else um, that lady or that woman cannot give birth. Mm-hmm. Um, you guys don't want to try this whole thing. The husband or somebody between the two does not want to explore uh, surrogacy or adoption. So then it leaves the option of taking in another wife for okay. I, everything. I, 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 I don't mean to be cocky, but this taking in another wife means no, she's not. Because I get it that will be in a I, I'm assuming that would be like a mutual agreement between the two. Because nowadays how quite okay, Gayak. Some people just do it, but Okay, in I, situations I, I, I'm like seeing, this. Wait, V. I see the comments here. Um Hofan is saying first time tuning in. Love the show already. Can we hear the colors too? Let my data. I'm so sorry. I think we had a um yeah, there was connection a little problem bad right network. there with our yeah. last caller. Um Kennedy Ponakaba is also saying the caller was mute, guys. We apologize. We are having technical problems with that phone call. But basically, the phone call, the gentleman who had called on Are, um, he to. is for polygamy. And Are, because how stress. So how's the cook? 
Usisikara. And also solve. Let us say my two. Ah, tamana se shop. Kur are ene hela matata ho abutsel. Mhm. Ale gano ke bo wife ba ba be. So that's 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 what we are discussing right now. And other callers should call in and Lelona please engage on the comment section. We'll read out your comment and like discuss a Lelona and so on. So as I was saying V, can I get If you're going to say people can marry more than one wife, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. One one wife. Alari, ha, I meet a guy. Guy A is a single. I jola guy A. So can guy A jola you also? Khore ra nyala mosa ke polygamy is allowed. Are nyala roti. Can I go to the house? He's going to focus on me, marry me, and go cheat. And it's called not cheating because polygamy is allowed. He might as well marry you. Can I want to cheat? Because with, 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 I don't know how it worked in the day. Right about now, but I, I don't know how correct. it worked in the day. Hey, yeah, let's not get it twisted. I am not against, I'm not for. Somewhere in the middle, guys. All right? No, guys. I, let's get it, let's not get it straight. Anyway, I wouldn't necessarily know how it would work, but I think the best approach would be Dubuisan, mm-hmm. right? Dubuisana is like the best remedy to things because you just can't. I'm so no. sorry. With me personally, I don't know what to And guys. and like I said, it has to be a mutual agreement between people because you know you personally, Tando, wouldn't want to do it. But somebody out there would be like, uh, especially people by Lungor Banali, um, open relationships, right? Open relationships where people want to engage a third person in their activities. Well, those, those relationships, people, relationship, can our, can our, can our open relationships. For those Guys. people who like open relationships, polygamy is like, I feel like polygamy, it could work for them. It could entanglement for them. Straight, straight. So tell me, so sharp. Let's say guy A gonna marry me, right? First of all, wah kunyala, and then what what inspires this man to marry the second person? Anza anala musarium. Kapen polelel. How many beds he batun? Rena mo how many beds? This issue boils down to two people understanding what they want if you strongly i, I, I always I, I i do this thing where i'm engaged in sessions with young women sometimes and i always say Hori, if you feel a certain way and it's about your relationship with whoever you are in it with i don't want one two three mm-hmm. i want one two three because that your views are supposed to be known Right? Mm-hmm. Um, I think we have a caller. Is it still on? All right. So, hello? Caller, hello? Caller? Caller, hello? Yeah, can you, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, Caller. Hi. It's in the air. Hi. Welcome to T-Trends on Thursdays. Uh huh. Yeah, I think uh, well, it, it could be a good thing. Mhm. Can you leave me alone? Go Four hundred and take one past the rest. Why a majority when you only have yourself to think about? No, but like Alone. Why be concerned about other people? You want to think about polygamy. Think about polygamy in your own situation. If you are comfortable with going ahead with polygamy and the person is, who is involved I think, with um, you. Kola, I think you are such an, uh, an a compassionate man. You know, <laughs> you are such a, a considerate man. 
gore ba bangwe ba 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 thelelwa ga go ama right i think we're having a, a, a serious problem with this with this hello corner. hi i can hear you clearly no nothing hello okay i can i can hear you now as i was saying cola i think you are very compassionate and and um considerate man you know cuz I, i wouldn't think it that far like you're saying kana go tsohala gore o ilibile ka e ganye na ke ilibile ka o phiri ma ha ke bo o tla fatla ke ma bone hello yeah hello yeah what if you do not satisfy me uh accordingly or properly ntogela papa we ko satisfaction ye according and ye correct alone yeah um betting i want i want to pull Now that is just so you know what if VV what what if VV can be wild and, and then Tando and Eke Mamur will be but yes. I want both Amen uh-uh. Amen to that Ah 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 Now that is just being selfish I think we can agree what polygamy is just like a selfish act guys It's Honestly. not If no. you say it from that that's why can Okay fine No, I'm just trying to open your eyes. We really live in all in all in all from all corners, man. Financially, o gona go re le sa fara financial, but when you add the third person, a batla go le thusa. Mhm. Le gona go e. Mo mahanya. E ma le gona go banganya le dingwe tse le rongwe ne re sa letse go morago tsa mo third person comes in o tla le thusa. even just the the the, the chores mola so thing let's say you all run a business o mo hatla o tla thusa gore no nani le go run a business i can actually cook mola thing you don't have to buy food you come home you eat nice i think majority of the people were thinking about polygamy in in terms of the sexual part of the relationship than the financial yes like now that you're exploring a, a big point. yeah the financial aspect and just the social aspect of you guys living together i think that is an eye opener okay yani ke re re go risk ga le ba hala o nna wa bona o ga ga mala hala re le be from all corners thank you so much thank you so much cola and good night well i think just to wrap it up it all goes back to saying kana you know sa khona le basadi ba bo me ba ile gore that comfortable with Like currently polygamy high you're right mm-hmm. but you know khona le ladies ba le gore ba te be ba re it's not there well yeah. i don't mind um at the end of the day he comes back to me gore ha re at the end of the day ora gore during the day wa o go kwa le kwa le ke ntse ke polygamy gore hala no ring but si sonke within them jolo guys do we have to settle that hey, is hey no settling is an it's an it's a personal decision it's either you settle for less or you settle for better price then i won't settle settle for less guys guys let's just wrap it up and leave you guys with that but all in all my last message for the day is ikakanye itse gore o mang tlhalogane se o sebatlang speak to your partner see if you guys are on the same boat and how let's skip and sell one and send all the spaces of other the other the other person go ahead fucking like gore gore go no era le france to say to as not a problem like any one of you uh, since khate ke di mutual uh, arrangements let us mutual decide gore big city am cuz ha ke go ha ke di ke ne so guys thank you so much for tuning in make sure to follow us on our social media pages i'm truly tando and this is at vva reloaded on your twitter and your instagram also there's a page vva like it love it and know, share <laughs> it and make sure you stay tuned each and every thursday at 8 p.m. to quarter to 9 p.m. on black network it's t trends on thursdays and i'm your idol butterfly and gemini with the swag of the queen of workout and slave it's a Christmas. good night hey on the tracks on the